What's up, you guys? Welcome back to Manifest Like a Boss. Over here, where we enter into the boss the fuck up zone, and it's just all the way real. Hit the subscribe button because I guarantee you're gonna love it over here. If you're tired and you're ready to turn up the fucking pot, turn up the heat, and get what it is that you want, email me right now at lovelysecret90 at gmail.com. And I'm gonna sit with you one on one on some boss shit. And we gonna make this shit happen. Also, go follow me on Instagram and TikTok. And you know what? Let's just jump right into this, okay? Y'all been coming through with the success stories. Y'all been coming through. Like, I want to give it to the clients that I've been working with who's been bossing the fuck up out of nowhere. Something just clicked in your head. And you like, you know what? What you said, do? Do this, do that. Okay, I'm doing it. You not wasting time you just doing what needs to be done and you know what i want to say congratulations to you all you are bossing the fuck up and and you changing the game you got your person that's cool okay now stay on your mental diet and you good now to the people who are still trying to do this shit get those affirmations out get them out and you're gonna stop changing them stop changing and rearranging the shit Make sure like you got some good ass affirmations and not that weak ass shit. Oh, they thinking about me. They miss me. Weak ass shit. You need some real shit that's going to wake they ass the fuck up. When you manifesting your specific person, it is very crucial that you do not be out here listening to all these sad ass songs. The sad songs manifest. Because your subconscious mind is listening to all of that. So if you're listening to all of that, your subconscious mind is listening to all of that. Stop looking on social media at the shit that's triggering you. If you are friends with your person, your specific person, and they on some dumb shit right now, unfollow their ass. That's not important. I'm telling you. You'll be able to be back on their shit sooner or later when they bring their ass back and they acting right. But right now, unfollow that shit because I'm telling you it's going to keep your ass stuck. You're going to be stuck and you're not going to get nowhere like that because see you, your brain is still looking at the disbelief that you see in their ass. Your brain is still focusing on all the bullshit that they own. You know, your, you keep looking at the dumb shit, feeding your brain the dumb shit. So that's what your subconscious mind is pushing out to you, reflecting back dumb activity. So unfollow their ass. We don't give a fuck about that. If you by yourself, you by yourself. And you wondering if they ass is with somebody. And you don't have no proof that they with somebody. But for some reason, you just think they with somebody. You are putting them with somebody. You think that, well, I can think this because ain't nobody around. It's just me. I'm, I'm in my room. Oh, I'm, you know, I'm in the dark. And I'm wondering about my SP. Wondering who the fuck they with. Your subconscious mind is taking notes. Or you might as well go and find somebody for them because that's basically what you're doing. You follow. You follow. Do you? You got to trick your subconscious mind into believing that you already have what you want. If you already have what you want, you're not going to be acting weak. You're not going to be crying. You're not going to be feeling sad. You're not going to be uh, telling everybody, oh, uh, he a fuck boy. Or telling everybody, I don't know why she did this. Like, um, she just left me. She ghosted me. She said she didn't want me. You're not going to be saying that. You're going to say the shit that you want. Because when you say your affirmations and you start, let's just say you say your affirmations, okay? You say your affirmations, everything is good. You know, they love me, all this good shit. Then... You turn around a week later or a couple days later and go and repeat the old story to your family, your brother, your sister, your friend. Then you know what you just did? You just revised that shit. And then you wonder why are you receiving hot and cold behavior? You want something different? You got to do something different. If you want something different, you got to move like a boss. You sit your beautiful or your handsome ass on the pedal stool like a fucking boss where you shine think about that for a moment i'm gonna see you in the next video